Oh, she is. That's she. Yes, she is. I remember. Look at that. That is the queen, Queen Bee. <laughs> Like I'm coming from the moon. <laughs> and you just have your normal clothes. I I think that they'll be fairly calm, so I just I like to use this if I can, but sometimes I wear the So I'm looking like this. <laughs> what is this you have? This is just uh it's actually just water. Um it calms them down a little bit if they're a little bit excited. Okay. I spray that on. It's uh, water with a little bit of lactic acid. And lactic acid they produce naturally and there's lactic acid in honey so it doesn't hurt them but it calms them down a little bit. Okay. If they're excited. And so you walk on the back, back side of the hive chain. Please. Yeah. You can see there's a lot of dead bees here, up here on the ground. Oh, they're dying. They're supposed to die now. These are summer bees that are dying now. Oh. And then, but the fact that they're still out flying means they still haven't packed themselves in for winter yet. So that means we can probably see the queen. Wow. Maybe, maybe, maybe. So. Yeah. Some people use smoke, yeah, and that, yes, that, that calms, them, that. calms them down, but I don't like to use it because I don't like to take the smoke machine down the elevator. But the way you are dressing now... And, but they generally... See can, I, can I also get strong? No, not really. They, it's possible to sting through, but you have, you have clothes on underneath and everything, so it won't happen. And if you, get, if you find that they're aggressive, you just walk. But no, you won't get stung. But you see, they how, are... How often do you do this? In the, in the season, when they're when we're taking care of them, when they're growing in May, June, then I have to be in here once a week to check on the bees. Wow. See, I'm spray this bit of the sun. Yeah. It comes them down? Yeah, and they think it's raining, so then they go down inside. Oh. So you're tricking them. It's so... Why people are so afraid of them, especially where I'm from? Yeah. Well, they are. They are more aggressive there, so they should be afraid of them. You have to wear protective clothes. Sometimes when it's nice weather and it's warm, yeah. I don't even wear any protective clothes because they just stay like this. Yeah. See, and I'll show you. I don't know if we can we'll be able to find the queen now, but at least I can show you what it looks like, a frame. Is it, is it one queen in each of the hive? One queen in here, one in there, one in there, yeah. Okay. Only one. If there's two, if there's another queen, they'll kill it. Last time, oh, they will kill it. Yeah, they'll only keep one queen. Wow. Last time I saw the queen. Now they'll probably become a little bit more aggressive when I take yeah, up this. Yeah, I see. Because they, you can hear that. You can hear the sound. They get a little bit more excited. They don't like being disturbed. Yeah. Winter, they've stored their winter food in here. So all the nectar they take outside. Oh, look at that! Oh, wow! See this? This here is. In here, there's nectar. Yeah. Honey. Yeah. And here, it's not. See here, it's wet. Yeah. It's not finished yet. They're still making honey. And some of the see the colorful. That's pollen inside those colorful orange boxes. Mm -mm. Boxes there. That's pollen. Wow. 
So what are they doing right now? Right now they're drying, drying out this shiny honey. Yeah. And then when it's dry enough, then they put on this wax cap. Yeah. To, pr to preserve it. So yeah, they're just working a lot. They're working. Yeah. See on this side, they're finished. Mm. It's all covered. See, it's all covered up with wax. Wow. Then we, that means this honey is prepared for the winter. Yeah. So we'll take out. It's impossible to know if the frame, if the queen is here or down there. So we probably won't find her now before the spring. But you have, you already have some other footage of a queen, so you can show what it looks I like. I hope I find it because I cannot find. <laughs> Oh, oh my god, it's kind of uh, difficult to watch, kind of like, but oh you see it's, oh my god, do you like doing this? Yeah, I like it very much, it's kind of, because they also pick up your mood if you're stressed, yeah, and you're, and you're kind of Sweat, rushed and maybe. jerky reactions, yeah, and they get more <laughs> aggressive if you're very calm <laughs> and relaxed. And they're more calm and relaxed. So you're looking for the queen? Yeah, just... But I, I don't know if we'll see her. But you see, it's not really... Why is there so many of them there? Probably there's more honey on that frame. Oh. More to do. Wow. See here, there's not really much honey. Yes, yes. But they they build this wax too. You know, they have to build this wax first yeah. to put the honey in. So that all oh, they've built themselves. Oh my God! They're perfect little engineers. They can make this perfectly in the dark. Imagine. Imagine. You saw one that looked like a queen, no? No. Mm. She's maybe done the bottom box. It's warmer up in the top box, so sometimes... Sometimes it's not possible to see her. Huh? Well, sometimes she's just so hidden, you know. Oh my god, the noise! I'm looking forward to come back again. Yeah. In this there oh, she is! There she is! I remember! Look at that! That is the queen, queen bee. <laughs> queen bee. Is she aggressive? No, and she can't sting. She won't sting us. She can't sting. She can. She can only sting other queens. She doesn't sting other. Uh, only if there's another queen, she would sting her. Wow. But she doesn't sting people. But she's very protected and respected here. Or? Yeah. See how the bees turn towards her when she's walking. They turn and face face her. Are you kidding me? Sort of attending to her in a way. Yeah. They move out of her way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my god. Are they getting aggressive now? No, but they do. The longer we wait, the more okay. irritated okay. they get. I think I'm taking enough of the queen. queen. Queen bee. <laughs> and all of the bees here are girls. There's no men there's no male bees here. Oh my god. All of these bees are female. It's always like that? Yep, and there's no male bees that survive the winter. All the, the few, male, few male bees that she makes, yeah. she makes in the spring, and then they live uh, through the summer, mm. and then they, they're there to fertilize other queens yeah. in nature. But in the f and then as soon as they do, the minute they do their thing with the queen, then they f fall dead to the ground. The minute they they inseminate her while they're flying in there, mm. their penis breaks off and they fall dead to the ground. Oh my god! Instantly. And so in the fall, the male, the boys that they have, fall and die. Yeah. And then in, as soon as they've done that, then they fall down and die. And then. Wow. Go back a little bit so you can see the hives. Yes. Oh, it's beautiful. Guys, I saw the queen. I saw the queen. The engineering work that is going on here is mind-blowing. Very, very interesting. Thank you, Eric. 
And now you can put it down in that slot just slowly, just aim it, just sink it slowly in there. I hope I don't harm some of them. It's okay. You'll be okay. It feels a little bit tight. Yeah, just, just do it slowly and it might be, might be stuck a little bit. It's a little bit too tight here maybe. Yeah, you can just I'm leave it there. I'll, I'll take the rest. <laughs> Good job! Ah, look at this! <laughs> wow! It's not safe to walk in front? Yeah, it's safe. You, don't, you just don't want to work there because you interrupt them flying in and out. Ah. You, can, you can go in front. I just want to show how many of them are dead on the floor. So many. And that's typical, you know, normally if it's grass here, nobody would see that, you know? Yeah. But since it's concrete, then you can see it. So that's, of course, a little bit too bad. We don't really like people seeing that. Yeah. <laughs> but it's completely natural. Guys, well, guys, you know that the bees at this time of the year, when they come out in Norway, they die. Most of them don't manage to go back. Most of these are all going to, half of these bees are going to die too. Yeah, yeah. So only we'll, half will survive the winter. Yeah. So what are you doing now? Just, Just scraping cleaning. off the dead ones because sometimes there's too many bees when I put the lid on then they get mashed. Oh. I'm going to try to avoid them getting mashed. So why is it that you get the honey? How do you harvest the honey? So those frames that we just took out? Yeah. Where I showed you the honey? Yeah. You just take those frames with you. Yeah. And put them in a centrifuge that sp spins around in this brings all the honey out yeah that we can do next time well that's what I'm doing actually right right now that's at this time of the year in yeah. the fall you harvest all the honey so next time in the May we're not going to take out any honey then there's taking it in can I can I see when you're harvesting Is yeah if you want um, we've got a friend coming tomorrow to do it yes to get 12 o'clock tomorrow I can do everything but Watch the honey so this is when they harvest the honey at this time of the year yes it's well they harvest it in in uh, yeah August August September but then it might sit around for a while until you have time to prepare the honey yeah so it's been harvested generally in August Wow okay girls <laughs> they're all girls they're all girls your friends and family oh that's so nice you know you get a lot of money from one hive it's true so they're not interested. They don't care about us, they don't care about our food. They don't want to take your jam off your sandwich or anything. <laughs> they just they just want to be left alone. Yeah. So they're more aggressive in the African bees because they have to be to chase away predators and also because sometimes it can be some areas might get really dry or something and they have to be able to move. So they're just checking out. <laughs> so they'll, uh, they're also smaller, smaller hives, smaller yeah. families, so they can move quicker. But here we breed on the calmest ones. So the, be the be bees that are the most calm, those are the queens we used to breed. Yeah. If they're aggressive, we don't breed their queen. Oh. So you have to, we get genetically very calm Good. bees here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But now at this time of the year, they don't really like to be bothered, and it's a little cold. So they don't, they may be a little bit more aggressive now, but usually in the summer, I can take a bee, bee frame full covered of bees and bring it over and wow. they won't, they'll just ignore you. You can eat the honey right off the frame, even if the bees are sitting on it. Wow. Oh, I'm looking forward to do that. <laughs>